you. All right. Where y'all from? Uh, South Charlotte. Oh, okay. great. I guess that's better than North Charlotte. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Body Maybe. serve. <laughs> Up here. Yes, it is. Now there's a couple other like rooftop bars right here, isn't mm -hmm. there? Yeah, but that one over there with the umbrellas is the pavilion. Mm -hmm. That big hotel. Just get some cheese and crackers. <laughs> nice. Does that work? Yeah. Now it's off? Yeah. <laughs> so, how's your wine? Very good. We're here at the rooftop and of... Uh, Andrew <laughs> <laughs> What is that? <laughs> again. <laughs> what is it? Look at it again.
No. <laughs> No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what's going on? Stop. Look, there you believe in ghosts, right? Huh? Okay, well, maybe a freaking ghost took it. I think a ghost took my damn ticket. Alright, we're finding the ticket. <laughs> Retracing our steps. Well, alright, then we went over here. Is it here? Alright. Then we went over here. Talk to the horse <laughs> Feed it to the horse. We are retracing our steps. <laughs> this is good. All right. Merry Christmas. Hey, how, how are, are you? you? You guys are rocking it. I love it. Well, I left a little orange piece of paper somewhere. I thought it was, might have been here, but it's not here. Hello. Wow, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. Cheers. Found the orange piece of paper. Our tickets. And. You know what? That happened before we went over there. Yeah, that's sad. <laughs> All right, where are we going now? I don't Here. know. Yeah, thank you. What is that? What does it say? Huh? What is that? It's our tickets. What does it say? Walking directions to the old city jail. All right. Bulldog tours. So he'd like to get picked up. Would that be doable? That's cool. Yeah, you want to take us around a little bit? That'd be awesome. Yeah, like, take us up whenever then. What are you drinking? Wine. Okay. Let's paint or take you out the, like, carriage tour ride or, you know, the house tour or something like that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Mine's up. Yeah. Well, I like to look about the buildings. This looks like a pretty important little spot here. What's this building here in front of us? It's the old exchange building. Okay. The bottom of the uh, Oh, okay, yeah. I think they actually held Blackbeard there for a time. So you gotta it out. Well, we went and saw the angel tree today. That's so badass. That's yeah. something, man. Crazy. <laughs> yeah. This is Rainbow Road right here. Rainbow Row. Yeah, yeah, I can see how people get freaked yeah. out just walking around. Yeah, this is wild. Christmas time, Christmas lights. Dude, this is really VIP, man. I appreciate this. <laughs> That's why she trolls them. <laughs> it really is. Yeah. Like, somebody like get in their cars and drive around, but it's like, can't really stop. Or... Yeah, you don't really get yeah. a chance to look at anything. So what's that there, man? That's pretty. That's, That's the yacht club there. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Now we're here on what they call what the battery. Yes, sir. Okay. Very nice. These are just private residents. Wow. <laughs> this house right here is the Tempest and also now. Also a 
This one here, huh? Yeah, old money. Can't even, yeah. That's a nice one. It's dark out here, man. Where are you taking <laughs> us? <laughs> This is out at Wolf Island, huh? Yeah. Shuttle the women to and fro. <laughs> it's real calm. Calm night. A little brisk. But it's pleasant. It's a good night to be pedaling. First day of winter? First day of winter? Oh, I'll be darned. We don't thank you for being here. On a personal note, I'm very humbled and honored I get to share this place with you tonight. Tonight, what is considered to be the most haunted building in the state of South Carolina. And we'll see what happens in here tonight. This is a very dark building. Please, I cannot emphasize this enough. Do not wander off on your own. But if you do get scared, if you do get scared in here, there is no shame in that. There is no shame in it. So if you get so scared, you think you're going to have to take off and run, please let me know. Mainly so I can get out of your way. <laughs> now, I will say one more thing. If you see me running, it ain't part of the tour. <laughs> the only thing that ever covered any of these windows were just the bars. And the only thing they had in here for bathrooms were buckets. Oh, one more thing before we go in. I ought to mention this too. There is a ghost that follows me around every time I work in this jail. She's been following me around for over 11 years. I don't know why. People take pictures of me sometimes and she'll, they'll see her behind me or beside me or kind of peeping around the door. We're going to tell you who she is in a little bit. But yeah, she's with us. And so uh, just bear in mind that... Um, we're not alone here, folks. So if you sort of get that weird feeling you, you're not by yourself where you're standing, you're probably not. First door there on the left. And as this weight plunges into the hole, these people simultaneously will launch into the air. And when that weight slammed into the bottom of that hole, it broke their neck. Or they dropped the weight and instead of them being yanked in the air and their neck broken, they just simply got hoisted off the ground. Now they're up there six, five feet off the ground and their neck is not broken. So they're up there just kicking the trash and choking to death on this road. That's a harsh way to go, folks. That's a tough way to die. I've been privileged in this jail to give tours in here for a long time. And coming along with that opportunity, I've had three opportunities. I've been on three TV shows in this jail. I've appeared on Ghost Hunters, Ghost Adventures, and Paranormal Stuff. <laughs>